What's wrong with that tape? What's wrong with that tape? Can't you see that monster? What's wrong with it? What's wrong? Have you seen it up close? It's fine. It just needs more slime. More slime. Oh, my God. Look, I know your expectations were high, but on a low-budget film... Expectations, On a low-budget film, we have to compromise. I was in a bad place financially, especially with the wife not working due to the year that we've had. She'd say, you're living the life of a single man and I'm living the life of a single mum. Everything was just so uncertain. I was having issues with these mood swings. They got to the point where my son just wouldn't talk to me, which was tough, especially during lockdown. But I imagine I wasn't very pleasant to live with most of the time. Well, I can't give you the exact time of death, but I can tell you that she died at least 12 hours before the body was found like all the others. So let me get this straight. The girl was killed and dismembered, right there in the middle of the street, and no one noticed anything for 12 hours. No, no. The murder happened someplace else. All I remember is this numbness, and the flames spread over my body. Eventually, someone took me outside and threw a blanket over me, but by then, the damage was already done. Cutlery drawers are all over the floor. Are you suggesting there has been an intruder? Uh, no, sir. I think it's most likely to have been an uh, incident with the cook. Incident? Yes, sir. He likes to drink, and I imagine he's had one too many to drink last night before he's gone home and uh, made a mess. I've taken a load of new rounds since they built the mouses on Baker Way. Now it's all for your regulars now, then, eh? Uh, I've always got time for the old favourites. And you're super fucking man. Or woman. Nothing can hurt you. So strong and sure about every decision you make. 